welcome everybody. How are you? Waiting for, for Kirk uh, in two years waiting. I hope uh, you are enjoying for this uh, next edition. Very special for you. We prepare something really special considering daylight, day short, but uh, the path will be very, very strong this edition. Enjoy yourself. Bene, benvenuti a tutti, è un piacere avervi ancora qui con noi in questo Kirk Enduro Day che prenderà tutta la settimana con eventi che ci piace ricordare saranno a disposizione per tutti voi nel corso della settimana. E dopo due anni quasi di attesa che questo evento eh, può accadere e quindi siamo tutti felici di avervi qui. Ja, liebe Teilnehmerinnen und Teilnehmer, herzlich willkommen zur 10. Ausgabe der Kirka Enduro Ride. Nach zwei Jahren Zwangspause sind wir wieder da. Wir freuen uns sehr, dass ihr so zahlreich erschienen seid. Wir haben einiges für euch vorbereitet, einige schwere äh, Tracks, aber äh, für das seid ihr ja hier. Also freuen wir uns drauf. Dear all, welcome to the 10th edition of the Kirka Enduro Ride. We are really happy to see you after more than one year in which we were conditioned by the uh, COVID-19 pandemia. So we are here all together and this is a good sign. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank uh, all the local authority and the sponsors that were supporting us also for this edition. Then I will thank you for coming and for making so many kilometers to enjoy with us uh, this uh, week uh, of uh, enduro uh, um, ride and uh, uh, enjoyable uh, days. So we are here for uh, uh, presenting the Kirk Enduro Ride um, uh, days. We have two days in which uh, you can run on a, a track which is either marked by ribbon and uh, uh, arrows or um, prepared by GPS track. Uh, we would like uh, to underline the fact that in the future will be nice for everybody to uh, learn how to use the GPS uh, system because this uh, is creating less impact on the territory because we don't need to put all the mark on the territory and uh, disturbing also the local population. By the fact, this year is uh, still a year in which uh, we present uh, a double uh, possibilities. So the day <coughs> one and the day two will be marked by different ribbon and uh, you, will you will also follow the GPS system. Of course, uh, uh, you have to understand that uh, uh, in case you drive also with the GPS uh, uh, track and in case you enter in conflict with the information between the physical uh, marking system, so ribbon and arrow, and the signal you have on, um, on your uh, GPS, please remember that the, the normal marking system, so ribbon and arrow, are pri priority in respect of GPS. That's because in case of the last minute changement in the, in the, in the track, we, our scout could, also, could only do by a normal marking. So if you are in conflict between the two, follow the standard marking system. As usual, we are offering uh, also some services, which uh, are uh, uh, tire service, uh, technical service, uh, washing uh, bike service, and uh, <coughs> uh, also um, some uh, photograph service. In the kit you received uh, during the registration, you have received also a map which is showing the track of the first and the second day. Please keep this uh, uh, information with you because you have 
not only the description of the, of the path, but also some uh, important information like uh, uh, petrol station, um, length in uh, uh, distance, and different uh, typology of uh, um, track you can find on, the, on your route. As you know, if you did already Kirkandura ride, and uh, if you don't know, I explain again uh, that this event is uh, based on a concept of a standard soft uh, uh, track, which is called for us green road, that is uh, enjoyable not only for the light bike, but also for the twins uh, or uh, eventually quad. From this, uh, I would say uh, soft uh, or uh, light, simple uh, enduro track. We have uh, some different branches. These branches are called the hard section. The hard section are not all, all of the same uh, distance and on the same level of difficulties. When you arrive to the cross between red and green or soft and hard, you will uh, get the information on the panel of the number, the chronological number of this section, the level of difficulties, which could be E as easy, M as medium, H as hard. And so you can decide it if you want to enter or not this section. We would like to remember you that anyway, we are uh, uh, riding in the uh, normal open uh, road to the traffic. So please drive, drive carefully and uh, take care of the people you have around of you. I also remember you speaking about security that we have a hub uh, for uh, um, emergency uh, a call, uh, which is called TRX Ride Finder, that you find on our website, and that you have to use to call for medical assistance or technical assistance. This app is very easy to be used because um, pushing the right button you send immediately your GPS position to the system and we can uh, check where you are. Otherwise, if the, the signal is not good or if you have some problem, you always can use the red and the blue line, so phone number that you have in the, uh, the map uh, sheet, in which uh, uh, you can find the number, you can use it, and in this case you have to um, send also via message your race number and your GPS position. Okay, so we are able to reach you everywhere on the track. Of course you can uh, do or not do as you like, but if you decide to participate to the, to the Primosten Trophy, then you have to run all the red section. And inside this red section, you can find different area in which you have the chrono test. Okay? You have to run this chrono test. And then at the end of the day, you have also to run the cross test beach, okay? So, only for the people, for the rider that runs every day, the two days, all the R section and the beach test, they will participate to the official ranking for winning the trophy. This year, as you understand, we were forced to move from normal April, May, uh, uh, timing uh, to November due to the COVID restriction and also due to the COVID restriction we were forced uh, to a little bit change uh, our standard organization. That's the reason why I am here speaking with you 
<laughs> in front of you and uh, in front of a camera and not uh, uh, in front of you physically. But uh, uh, the second uh, important point is that we were forced due to the light, uh, limited light in the day, uh, to short the track. You will not drive for 160 or 170 km per day, but approximately uh, around 100 km and you will uh, reach the break time, the break lunch, uh, at the end of the day. I remember you that it's mandatory to come to the start and register the start and register the end of your race because otherwise we are not in, in a condition to follow you and uh, uh, we don't know that you are on the track. So in this case you cannot be part of the ranking and you cannot be part of our uh, uh, security system. Coming inside the, the, the events, uh, we go in the day one. So you see the map and you see the, the track length, that is the first day, uh, 100 kilometers. You have to memorize the color of the ribbon that in this case is, yellow, is orange with a KTM, right? Uh, the uh, fuel uh, station is foreseen after 50 km. And the, na the name of the track you have to follow if you use GPS are KE 2021 day one C A or C B for the ones that run the red uh, track or KA 2021 day one S A or S B if you run the green or the soft uh, track. Why we have two different separate uh, track in GPS? Because one is bringing you from uh, Primosten to the fuel station, that is the, the, the track A, and then you have to change to the track B to come back at home. Okay? And the start is foreseen at 8 o'clock in the morning from Piazza Rudina. Uh, so you can start the alignment around 7 o'clock and then we perhaps we can have a short last briefing at 8 and then you start. Normally we start uh, 3 or 4 pilots every minute. Okay. On day 2 um, we have more or less the same distance. So also from the day two, you will run approximately 100 km. GPS track, which is called KE 2021 day two, and then again CA or CB, again start eight o'clock from Rudina place. And uh, uh, in these days, you do not have any fuel station available. So please take care of your uh, you know, driving because you have to be in condition to drive the 100 km without any uh, refueling uh, possibilities. Remember that we will have uh, our marshal placed in some part of the track to check uh, your regular passage from this uh, part of the track. So don't escape it. The last uh, test uh, on the beach uh, will be open uh, uh, around uh, one o'clock in, in the afternoon, uh, depending on the number of people arrived. Uh, and then at the end of the second day, 
uh, you will have not only the lunch time and the lunch break, which is just at the end of the day, but also the prize giving ceremony that will take uh, uh, close to the beach, uh, just behind the Congress Hall at uh, uh, 5 p.m. in the evening, just to close our uh, uh, Kirk Enduro week. We have uh, good weather and so we are here for enjoying the two days. So thank you very much and see you soon.